Hey everybody, so I just came back from my LA um, birthday trip and I had fun. I went to Disneyland, I went to Universal, I went to dinner for my birthday, I went to Emerson Theater Nightclub. That was fun. Um, but now I'm back and when I got back I had like about five boxes sitting at my front door and um, I guess it was like all my birthday gifts I had came in while I was gone. Um, my mother-in-law got me um, a whole entire line of like stress relief bath products like the bath salts and the body wash and the lotion and the new loofah and it was really awesome but I've showed stuff like that before and I just figure I'll keep this simple since there's so much makeup to go through. Um, my wonderful friend Jeff uh, went to IMAX because I couldn't. I really could just couldn't. It was the worst timing ever. They changed the date of IMAX this year. Everyone knows it's not normally in January, I don't think. Um, it's normally during the summer and I always have a hard time getting off of work because that's our busiest season. And this year they decided to do it in January, which would have been great, except I had to go home to Miami to visit my family. Um, so, I had to miss it. But um, since he knew that I was super, super upset that I couldn't go, he picked me up a few things and sent them out to me for my birthday, and I thought that was super sweet. So, first thing that he did is he got me the Sigma Make Me Blush um, makeup collection. So, I guess it's like all of the brushes that you could need for the kit. It says eyeliner, pencil, tapered blending, eye shading, larger shader, small angle, medium angle shading, large powder, large angled contour, dual fiber, foundation, and concealer. So like this whole thing has like everything. Isn't this really, really beautiful, I want to say like leather um, case that is absolutely genius because every time I go out of town, I basically have to put my brushes inside the makeup bag and then if it bends a certain way, the bristles stay that way. Like it dries or kind of um, messes up the brushes, so it's just really bad. Um, I've tried using them in different ways, like packing them in different ways. Everything just risk running, like you run the risk of messing up your brushes. So this is actually awesome, and it's a beautiful color, and it's, it's like sturdy, it's really thick. So this is awesome, it says Sigma on it, and it has snaps on the sides. I think it's like leather, I'm not sure. Oh, it's so awesome. Um, first impression is the brushes are gorgeous. Never touched one, never seen one in person, so I'm going to let you know what I think of the hair. Just great for after you um, you wash your brushes. It's very um, useful for that, so I'm going to keep that. But Right off the bat, it's a very soft, really good quality brush. This one's the, 450, the F50, sorry. It's your kind of like your staple foundation brush. So really liking that, the quality of it, you can tell how nice it is. It's like a metal up here, and I believe like a wood at the bottom, and it's red with pink kind of tinted tin metal. I don't know what that is, but really nice. It comes with all of these brushes, which anyone who is starting off, like, who needs a starter kit to do makeup, I think every major important, majorly important brush that you can need is in this kit. One thing that I really wanted that I was going to pick up no matter what at IMADS and it was their Sigma Beauty Expert and it's basically your eyebrow palette. Everything you need, you can see that everything's black and white and then her eyebrows are pink. It's everything you could need for your eyebrows and it even has a little book in the front to show you what to do, how to use each product, um, just everything, everything. So, this is my first time opening it, I haven't opened it yet. It's in a sleeve. All of these colors, for every color under the sun, so no matter what um, hair color or brows you have, you are taken care of. Little scissors for your eyebrows, a brush for your eyebrows, a gel and a clear gel, your highlight and um, pencil, like everything that you need to fill them in. They even come with stencils and a professional pair of tweezers and a mirror. So if you're using just this kit 
And wherever you're going, you have a mirror. So this is going to be, oh, it also has a sharpener, sorry. Completely skipped over the sharpener. Because these, um, these pencils are a lot thicker than normal, than most eyeliners. So it comes with a pencil sharpener that fits that. So that's awesome. And I don't know how much any of this stuff costs, but I'm sure you could look it up on their website. It is amazing. He also sent me out some new designs for Violet Lips, which is really awesome because I am in love. I really wish I would have gotten these before Valentine's Day because I would have worn these to dinner for sure. Little hearts. <laughs> love it. Love it. They also have the fully red ones with um, the little heart in the center. They have ones that say love. Ugh. For work, I'm definitely going to use these. <laughs> Shamrock. Really, really cool. And then what? Getting money, bitches. Alright, I went to MAC and did some damage. I know, right? MAC always will always be the death of me. This receipt is crazy. Okay? So, while I was there, I picked up the um, Volcanic Ash Exfoliator. Every time I try to pick it up, it's always gone. And Michael, who I normally shop from at the um, Town Square location, um, raves about it to me all the time, and I finally found one because they've been out of it for so long. And, <clears throat> and I bought it, so... I'm really excited to use it. <clears throat> this looks like it has shimmer in it too. And let me see if I can open it. Nope, it doesn't open. Basically, it's black tar with chunks of like exfoliating, like ash in it. And you can see it's like jet black and it has grains in it. Also got this paint pot, which I'm in love with. It's Dangerous Curve. Oh, sorry, Dangerous Cuvée. Le Le French. Oh, wee oui, wee. Oui. And it's beautiful. The reason why I picked it up is because, it, to me, it's great as an eyeshadow with nothing over it. So pretty. I don't know if you can see it. It's got glitter in it, but... Anyway, it's a really gorgeous grayish lavender color. So with a peachy pink highlight like this, it just gives you enough that you glisten without looking like you put on highlight. This one's shell. This one is called Chilled on Ice. Like champagne. That would make sense. It's kind of like a champagne color. So it's beautiful. Love this. Again, these are perfect if you don't want to wear anything else. You have everything all in one. Let's see, let me see, let me see. When you turn your hand, or when you turn your... your I also got this other cream color base. So the other one was more pink, and this one is a little bit more bronzy. You can see this one's shell, and this one is improper copper. It's got a little bit more of a bronze to it. Alright, went to Sephora. I know, it just never ends. And I got myself this Glitz and Glam kit. So the other day I bought the white one of this, and then I was like, you know what, I really wish I would have gotten the gold one. And then I saw this kit, I was like, it's worth it, for sure, because this by itself was like 30 bucks. So everything else in here is just an extra. Um, I really like everything that it comes with and um, the bag more than anything is so cute. I'm also considering this the glow dentist whitening thing that you can do at home that Sephora sells so if any of you use it please let me know if you like it. And I believe this is last but not least. I don't think there's anything else but Sedona Lace sent me another packet of um, brushes. So you guys know that I have these, and I showed you these when it first came in, and I loved these. I use these every single day, literally. I use this flat one for my foundation sometimes, 
I used this one angled for my um, blush. And then I used this dome one, kind of. Um, this one's a little bit more dense. It doesn't really fluff out as much. So I use that to contour my nose. And I love it. Love it. Between this and this brush that I got at Walmart back when I was in high school, mind you, that is super kind of like short and stubby, just like this one. Um, these both are great for that. This one works a little bit easier because it's a smaller head than this one. This one's so fluffy it kind of pushes it out other places. But both of them for me are amazing for contouring, for um, anything, just placing anything for contouring. So they were nice enough to send me um, the rest of the Midnight Package, I believe it's called. And I love these brushes because they're so different. You can see how pretty they are. They're pink and it fades out to black, like an ombre. <gasps> Look what I got. Oh, another flat dome one. This is even better. Yes! <gasps> I'm so excited. <laughs> That's awesome. Look how many little ones. Like you can use any of these for contouring around your nose. This is going to be so cool. I love these angled flat ones for taking right where the pointy point goes into the end and doing some of this. It's perfect for that. Love that. I love, love, love that. So, um, this is just the most awesome birthday ever. I've got I've gotten so many, gotten so many brushes. I don't even know what to do with myself right now. All right, guys. So that's the um, end of this haul, this birthday haul. All the stuff that I got for my birthday. Um, my husband also got me a perfume, and my best friend Michelle also got me a perfume, and she got me a bottle of champagne, like a really pretty pink champagne, and a beautiful bottle. Um, I got a little um, Victoria's Secret body wash and lotion and body spray set. Soft and cozy, I think it is. It smells so yummy. It's perfect for winter and fall. It just has that really musky, kind of soft um, cashmere smell. Love it. And my friend Marisol got that for me. Um, I think that's it. I'll post pictures of all those things on my Instagram and you guys can check it out. Bye, guys.